Aquarius. So somebody should, could have you torn in between the two. <laughs> is that what's going on? Is that what this full moon is bringing to light for you guys? You really don't know what to do. You feel torn. You want to stay. You want to go. Okay. Let's see what this full moon and Capricorn has brought to light for my Aquariuses. Um, please keep in mind that the rose and the greeting can be reversed. I could be saying you. It could be them. I could be saying he. It could be a she. Okay. Flip flop the rose according to your situation. You be your own leader of discernment when it comes to this reading. You pick and choose what fits and what does not fit. If a part of this reading does not resonate to your liking, leave it for whoever it does resonate with because it's a general reading. It's not a private reading, so it will not resonate with everybody the same. <laughs> Take what fits, leave the rest. Try your sun, moon, rising, Venus sign, or any other sign, any other reading I post with a title that sticks out to you. I feel like I just repeated myself. I hate that I do that sometimes. I feel like I repeat myself. All right. But anyway, background surrounding energy. Um, I feel like I wanted to be this. Somebody secretly wants to move away with the chariot. Six of Wands in reverse. Somebody secretly wants to move away. Okay. You will have victory and success over this. Stop worrying about what the other people have to say about whatever it is that you're trying to do. You will get over it. Okay. But judgment and ace of pentacles in reverse. Woo. Somebody's trying to keep it on the low that they missed out on the opportunity or they stole something or they, they, ooh, they took something. They missed out on a lot. They're losing a lot. What the hell is going on? Somebody has a lot that they want to accomplish or get going, but they just don't know how to do it. Okay? They feel like it's a... Mm. Seven of Swords in reverse and death in reverse. Somebody being sneaky and deceptive and trying to get out of this transformation. It could be a Scorpio. It could be a Libra. Justice in reverse. Seven of Swords in reverse. Somebody's being very unfair, unbalanced, and doing some illegal ass shit. Sneaking around and getting, trying to do some things, okay? For the other half of you guys. Somebody's trying to figure out a way to get away, take, to get out of the responsibility that they need to do in order to get the project done. It's like you have something on your mind that you're trying to get done big. You're going to acquire something big, but whether it's a property, a business, um, um, a house, a car, something, a loan. You're trying to acquire something that is worth a lot, a lot of money, okay, value in it. But you're trying to get, a, the way you're trying to get around it or get to it, it's like you're trying to skip over some steps, okay? <laughs> some of you guys are trying to figure out how you're going to get out of a marriage or a commitment, okay, or a relationship. Some of you guys are just not seeing eye to eye with this person no more. What is the chariot? What is the chariot? How do you sleep? Somebody's like, how do you sleep at night? What the hell is going on? What happened? What? Four of Cups in reverse. Somebody's ready to come up out of this depression that they've been in. There's been a lot of rumors and gossip and emperors in reverse. Somebody could have, there could have been a third party that, um, ruined a relationship or ruined your self-esteem this person cheating on you could ruin your self-esteem it could be frenemies somebody feeling like they don't have what it takes somebody because they went through a miscarriage somebody could be a little bitchy somebody could have like a creativity block somebody is being spiteful and envious with this five of swords somebody is trying to win at all costs and one up somebody they don't need to be it's like somebody is in this competition with somebody that they shouldn't be and it's not it's not making them look so good okay page of pentacles in reverse is actually stopping you from um from birthing something new or um expanding your horizons or manifesting whatever competition somebody is in is mental competition look somebody is jealous it could be a mother figure it's stopping somebody's potential and growth okay this competition is like slowing you down whatever competition whatever this is in or whatever conflict this other person is whoever this is is trying to win at all costs is slowing them down what is this chariot and that's why somebody's ready to move on because it could be the person that you're with they're like in this, this competition when it comes to you and you're like why the hell are you in competition with me you know what i'm saying you should be with me we should be working together what is the chariot what is the chariot Six of Wands in reverse again. So somebody feels like somebody's worrying too much about what people have to say in the public. Like somebody's trying to keep up with the public right now. That's the worst thing to do, you guys. I think everybody has been there, right? Trying to keep up with like social media and shit. That will ruin your fucking life, okay? It will ruin your fucking life. It don't even have to be just like keeping up. It could be like with the images or you looking at these women that posting all these pictures every day looking happy, looking cute. And you're like, how the fuck are they? You know, you're trying to keep up with it or you're making yourself feel down and out because you don't look that way and you 
you don't feel pretty you're not getting all those likes and how are they getting all this engagement and how are all these people liking them and how they have all these followers and this and that you would get caught up in the matrix and you don't want to be caught up in the matrix you gotta remember we're still you know we still got real shit to do it's real life there's a lot of people out here that ain't even caught up in that you gotta remember that okay it's really that's another world and you don't get caught up in that you gotta figure keep 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 grounded. Remember, we got real responsibility to take care of around here, okay? Social media, sometimes you can't pay the bill, but sometimes it can't, okay? A million views is not a million dollars for everybody. If you got other businesses and stuff and all the other stuff, y'all get what I'm trying to say. So don't, don't, somebody, it's like somebody trying to go viral just to go viral or get some views just to get some views. It's like you don't even have the steps in order. You don't even know what you're going to do with them views. Or what's going, somebody who's like want to get famous off of Instagram. It's like what you going to do when you get famous. Like do you know what you want to do? Do you want to be a brand ambassador? Do you want to own a business? Like what do you want to do? Like somebody needs to get the steps and the plans in order or something of that nature. But you're going to be all right, okay? But somebody needs to just stop worrying about the community and the people and how they doing it and what they doing and comparing yourself or something of that nature um or this is the person that you're dealing with they're like how are the people around us going to view you if you do this or you move on or what is going on with my Aquarius it's, it's a lot what's going on with my Aquarius is some of you guys could be dealing with a, a cancer. Three of Cups in reverse. There's a lot of people around you that's trying to stop your growth or stunt your growth. You guys are dealing with some frenemies right now. These people are in secret competition with you. This Three of Cups in reverse. They're, this is bad company. Three of a crowd. This is too much. It can even be a third party situation. Again, somebody could be viewing or watching somebody's third party on social media and they have somebody acting out and doing some things that they shouldn't in this competition. What is this Three of Cups in reverse? Somebody, not somebody's friend. What is this three of cups in reverse? Somebody could be overindulging or partying too much. These people could be bad influences on you. What is this three of cups in reverse? What is this three of cups in reverse? It's like somebody trying to put the blame on somebody as well, too. Then we have the emperor. It could be a lot of rumors and gossip about a man, an Aries. Somebody needs to take full. Somebody could be saying that somebody needs to get in control of their life. Okay, somebody could be saying that somebody's unstable, off balance, and we got the devil in reverse and nine of swords. And somebody knows that somebody needs to detach from this devil energy. It could be a Capricorn in here, somebody could be going to jail, or somebody's in the mental entrapment. Eight of Pentacles in reverse, whatever they did, it did not work out. Somebody sees that this situation is not working out and they need to detach from it. It could be a habit, it could be a person, it could be, it could be a thing, or it could be a situation. It's just not working out, but it's, it's still some unfinished business. Somebody feels like they're always in a never ending cycle with this person. Okay, they're always getting caught up in some bullshit. Oh, shit. Y'all, what is this three of cups in reverse? I think I need to close my window. What is this three of cups in reverse? I'm going to close my window after this reading. <laughs> Temperance in reverse and ten of pinnacles in reverse. So somebody could have been overindulging and because of it, and because of, and as a result of that, they could have lost out on the lot. It could be a marriage. It could be a home. It could be some money. It could even be they got encouraged to steal some things or take some things. Somebody is wondering if it was all worth it. Eight of Pentacles, five of Pentacles. Somebody is going broke and now they got to work hard to get it back. Or somebody doppelganged somebody or stole something by acting at somebody. Okay, somebody obtained something in the, in the fucked up way. This could even be the police questioning. There's a lot of rumors and gossip going on around a family dynamic, a third party situation, a marriage, a commitment, an ending, or some illegal dealings. Three of Wands. Somebody out of this. This somebody is thinking about leaving. Somebody's getting bored and discontent with this situation. Somebody's thinking about leaving and ghosting somebody because they're just over it. Okay, they're over it. Who Aquarius is? What's going on, with my Aquarius is? Sometimes it take it. it you, we gotta just get fed the fuck up. We got to sometimes. Sometimes we gotta allow ourselves to get fed the fuck up so that we can be uh, comfortable to leave. Because if we don't be fed up, we gonna be so emotional and stuff, you know. So, but once we get fully fed up, then we really we ain't gonna have no problem with leaving. Okay, the chariot, you the first got your back. Like you will have whatever it is that you decide to do, whether you leave, you stay, whatever you do, you will have victory over it. You gonna be all right. You got help. You you gonna be all right. What's going on, with my Aquariuses? seven of wands in reverse so somebody might need to let down their old defenses let down their guard when it comes to this situation for some of you guys you were defending somebody for far too long that you know you need not to anymore 
okay you was you was defending the old belief that you had within yourself when it came to this situation or this person and you let it go what's this seven of wands in reverse what's this seven of wands in reverse some of you guys are dealing with a Sagittarius and the Aries and the Can. I already said that already. Though. What's the Seven of Wands in reverse? Ace of Swords, Three of Cups in reverse. So the truth is, if there's a third party, if there's a lot of rumors and gossip, are these people are your frenemies? Nine of Pentacles in reverse and Nine of Swords. Somebody could offer somebody some money as well to, in order to do something, and that's not coming. Are these people that are trying to hold you back from your self worth with that seven of, with that nine of pentacles in reverse? The top, the the world. This cycle has came to a completion. Okay, this is a cycle that you have to go through. Three of pentacles. You're gonna get the help and the collaboration that you actually need. But I see, I think somebody sees clear as day that whoever they were dealing with was just trying to bring them down and keep them down. They did not want this person to move forward. They were trying to make this person take the blunt end of the stick. What is this seven of wands in reverse? Like trying to throw them under the bus? Trying to hold them back? What's this seven of wands in reverse? King of Swords, Ace of Cups in reverse. So the truth is, this was a draining, exhausting situation. Okay? It was not what somebody thought it was going to be. Fake love. Ten of wands in reverse. It's best you release it because it's burning some now. What's going on with my Aquariuses? What's going on with my Aquariuses? Five of Cups in reverse. So it's time for somebody to stop crying over spilled milk. This was a missed opportunity. Okay, but it's time for you to start investing in something new. Okay, somebody could even see that they invested in a cricket in a cricket opportunity. Okay. A fucked up opportunity that was never going to get off the ground, okay? It was, it was built to be messed up from the get-go, alright? What's this five of cups in reverse? Judgment in reverse, yeah. Somebody was using the wrong judgment. Nine of swords, and somebody wants to apologize. Somebody's heavily in regret over whatever it is that they did for some frenemies, for some people, somebody, or somebody that did not have their best interest. Somebody sees that. Think, which you don't see to a sort of will of fortune. Things are going to go in your favor. You're going to be okay, okay? The sun does come out. It ain't going to be raining for heaven. But somebody for sure was not using their right judgment when it came to this situation. What's judgment? Not judgment. My nose ring. What's this? Five of Cups in reverse. Five of Swords. Three of Cups in reverse. Back to these frenemies, these foes. These are some haters. They're trying to win at all costs. There was for sure some type of blackmail, slander, whatever. Somebody was trying to do whatever and anything to hurt somebody, to harm somebody, to hold somebody back. King of Cups and the Lovers because somebody loves somebody. So this was all somebody's friend of me is doing. Somebody knows that somebody loves somebody and wanted to be with somebody. This was a divine partnership. But yet somebody purposely, purposely did some things, gossip, rumors, encouraged somebody to do some sneaky, deceptive things to make this be a missed opportunity. Some people teamed up with one another to ruin a divine partnership. Oh, wow. This is kind of... Okay. What's going on, my Aquarius? Nine of Swords in reverse, Six of Wands in death. So, somebody's gonna be able to come up out of these sleepless nights. Um, somebody wants a transformation. I'm sorry. There's gonna be a transformation. There's gonna be an ending that comes publicly. Okay. Somebody will have victory and success over this situation, okay? There's a transformation that somebody is going to be going through, and they're going to get the help to go about it. What's going on? What is this Nine of Swords in reverse? Six of Wands, the Ace of Pentacles in reverse. So this for sure was a missed opportunity. Somebody missed out, or somebody could have even stole 
an opportunity from somebody lost a lot of money but then we got nine of swords two of cups so somebody is heavily in their head the empress and nine of pentacles in reverse somebody could be even be pregnant to be finding out they're pregnant if this person lost a lot of money or is losing money or is broke now somebody don't know what to do when it comes to this commitment this relationship if somebody knows they want to get it together they need to get it together somebody's trying to find out how to come in terms with this how to get um somebody's trying to figure out how to get balanced within themselves okay somebody's trying to come, trying to figure out how they're going to come up out of this betrayal somebody feels like they betrayed themselves by dealing with these people or this person because all they did was bring the instability to the instability to their foundation or to their peace of mind What's going on with my Aquariuses? Oh yeah, somebody for sure was stealing, thieving and stealing. Somebody was stealing and thieving, thieving and stealing. What's going on? Father figure, lonely, and then their future. And now this, whoever this person was that was stealing, now they gon' now they lonely. They will be lonely. Yeah, pay attention. Pay attention. Somebody was stealing just to go cheat. That's crazy. So what? They're trying to harm you. Create the life that you want. This person didn't want somebody creating the life that they wanted. So they were trying to harm them to stop them from going out and shining. Pack your bags. Illegal dealings. False appearance. Yeah, somebody was wearing a false appearance. They was only in it to scam somebody. They was doing a whole lot of illegal dealings. Damn, that's crazy. What's going on? Father figure, resentment, and abuse. And this father figure is about to be holding on to a lot of resentment for the abuse that they did. They could even been physically abusive, mentally, emotionally. But somebody was wearing a false mask. They was only in it to steal and the cheat they, they like they went out and cheated and stole like they stuck y'all heard what i said y'all this is crazy and they're spiteful y'all i love y'all so much take care